So lovely good morning. Um, as you can see right here, I'm at Organic Farm 7. So this is our comfrey field. Um, we have a field where we grow comfrey for fertilizer and we're just harvesting. And in rain season, it does extremely um, very well. So as you can see, we were just replanting some spaces just to make sure that we have um, enough fertilizer for our crops. We don't have to be buying fertilizer. We grow fertilizer so we don't struggle, okay? So coming down this side, um, as you can see, um, let me do some crop inspection in this organic field seated next to the fertilizer. How do you expect it to be hungry? Okay, how do you expect it to be hungry? You can see the maize. Look at the cover crop. There's cassava. Uh, you know, it's the issue of biodiversity, biodiversityification. Look at the crops, the cover crop. Um, and right now you can see there, it is raining actually. So we're having some drops of rains, but we haven't had enough rains. You can see the cobs. Okay, you can see the cobs. Okay, organically grown. Look at the density. When it rains, how do you expect the water to run away? Huh? You guys are using weed killers. You're killing your crops and you're killing your soils too. Look at that cob. Huh? <laughs> oh, you people. <laughs> So as you plant this year, let no one cheat you. Let no one, I mean, let no one cheat you. Look at the coverage. Chihuahua here, very happy. Look at the cassava. The cassava, <laughs> the maize, organic. Look at that. Look at that. You see, look at that. And the people say, no, organic what? We just use comfrey. We've been building our soils and now we're reaping the results. You just have to be patient. Patience pays, they say. <laughs> so they say patience pays and this is what it means. Patience pays. Organic farming doesn't want quick, quick things. <laughs> quick things are bad. <laughs> and, 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 and if you can see what I'm talking about is one thing that you can only find in our crops is... No armyworms. <laughs> look, look at the leaves. No armyworms. This is a clean field. Clean. No virus. No hot water. Chan chan. No virus. <laughs> you know, sometimes these things that we put in our fields, they bring about problems. Viruses. Then you'll be running up and down fixing symptoms instead of focusing on the root cause. At farm seven, we do the right thing, okay? So now, we have this maze. Look at how it is well covered. When I was growing up as a child, this is how we used to grow things. I remember very well. Going to the field, um, well covered. And uh, you see, just look at the coverage. Pumpkins have covered so, so, so well. Because they are growing like this. And you see, what has been pruning the maize here, it is the goats from the neighbors and the cows. They push their heads in. You can see how it has been pruned. It would have crossed. But uh, you see, you say, they, my friend, oh, they come here and sit under this lovely organic tree of ours because our neighbors have, have been killing their trees and they, they use dangerous things. But us, we don't. We are uh, very good people. Very good. Look at that. I can't go in his work this, but just look at how it is covered and the maze is up. So having said that, I'm wishing you a great morning. Build your soils, um, buy comfrey from Farm 7 and start making your fertilizer. Build the soil that will retain moisture and give you nothing but, but, I mean, I mean, but, but the best, but the best. So this morning, as you go wherever you are going, <laughs> As you are going to be planning on what to plant, Farm 7 is the place. Farm 7 is the place, okay? So then on the other hand, you see, we don't know how much rains we are going to have. We don't know. We don't know how much rains we're going to have. Um, you need 
to start working on your solar. Don't wait until you are in trouble. You can start uh, doing that. And you see, those are swinging solar stands. That Farm 7 there is very powerful, well secured. You just have to break them to get them if you want to get broken ones anyway. <laughs> but you know, we do proper solar installation. Proper, I mean proper. Standard, just look at how those stands are standing and they swing. You see, you can do this. We do on commercial scale, a small, like starting with the smallest 0 0.75. 1 HP, 2 HP, and you see, sometimes you ask question, how much am, it is hard to predict, like every solar installation is unique, so there is no fixed price for those things, because our approach is to solve the problems, not to tell you the price, so we have to understand what you want, how much water you need, so don't worry about, you know, what, what, no, just call us and we're going to assess the situation and give you the best advice, stay blessed and stay super, super, organic you can see our papayas there <laughs> and we're going to end right here i have to test this maze very soon